Hey guys and welcome back to FS19. Um, going to be doing something a bit different today. I, I never do potato harvesting. I normally don't really have any desire to do it either, but I was feeling like doing something different, so I actually went and planted a whole paddock of potatoes and um, I thought I'd, you know, do a recording and actually do a harvest of potatoes. So Jeremy's currently topping, Brandon's already started harvesting. Um, so we'll probably join in with them very shortly. Um, but yeah, let's do some potato harvesting. It's a little bit different, something that I don't do, so I'm going to be quite new at this as well. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it, and let's get into it. I'm kind of nervous about doing this, because I don't really know what I'm doing. I don't know how far I need to sit over here, or... It's just the same as regular harvesting, except skinnier. Let's make it up as you go. Is that what you're doing? Yep. Have you even done this before? Because I haven't. Uh, not with this. I've done it with the big one. Yeah, this is new to me. I don't do potatoes. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're in position. Um, I've never done this like I stated before, so I guess we'll turn it on. That's the implement on. I've never even used this machine before, so let's give this a bit of a go. Might switch over to my pedals really quick, and we'll use the steering wheel because it's probably going to be a little bit, a little bit better. I would do it in first person, but I'm not really sure yet if I want to, so we'll just do it in third for now. Um, I probably won't record the whole thing. I'll probably do it in stages or something, edit bits out and stuff. So, like I said, I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get into it. So far, so good. It looks like it does two rows at a time. We're already up to 1400 in it, which isn't too bad. Brandon's trying to get a headland done so that we can do a U-turn down here a lot easier. That's currently what he's doing, that's why he's going on that angle, which is okay. We'll just wait for him to move. No big deal. We'll just gradually move forward. Um, I thought we'd use the big 7R actually, I haven't really driven it much. I always use my front end loaders and all that, so I thought we'd get her out of the shed, use her. And that's one row done, which was nice. I don't know what Brandon's trying to do here. Are you just, are you trying to back up or what are you trying to do? I was seeing if you had enough room to turn around. Yeah, not to go back down though. I'd have to maybe go here, which I could do. I mean, I don't know, is there a right or a wrong way to even harvest this? No clue. Me either. So we'll just, we'll just go with it, we'll... We'll just go with that. I, I don't think it would matter a whole lot. You can see what's been harvested and what hasn't, so... I'm already up to 35%. I'm almost up to 50. I fill up pretty quickly, to be honest. At 10Ks an hour. Not a huge amount of speed in them. No. Oh, you're coming up that way, nice. I might just go back down the same one that I just did. Be an interesting job to do IRL, I think, this one. I don't know if it would be for me.
And I'm full. I'll come up to you, Jeremy. I'll just come back down. Alright. Oh, I gave the trailer a little love tap there. Yep. Just saying hello. Making sure it looks used. Yep. That's mm -hmm. it. Good thing it's Jeremy's trailer, not mine as well. What's that creep doing? Creeping around his tractor for? Looking. Seeing what Make sort sure of... everything <laughs> in working order. Yeah, making sure there's no damage. Yeah, I'm about to be full. Probably get a little bit up this run here, I reckon. The back of the trailer whack that post. I love how both our trailers are going to be full on the correct side to unload as well. It's just like we timed it that way. <laughs> yeah. Go in reverse, you stupid thing. Yep, I'm full. Is that how much we... that you got? Mm-hmm. It's not too bad. Oh, wait. It's given you the money, actually, so I don't have to keep a record. No, I didn't get the money. Are you sure? Yes. Because I didn't either. No, nope, I still got 36 grand like I had when I started harvesting. Hmm. That's weird. This could be a close encounter as well. It probably will be. Uh, I'm full, Jeremy, if you want to start rolling this way. Oh. You're full as well? No. Oh. <laughs> I think I... I thought we timed that perfectly and you were full as well. No, the hitbox isn't quite correct. Oh, was you like for you hitting it or something? Yeah. Oh. For me, I was running into you. Yeah, for me, you were I uh, maybe a little bit off. There's still a bit of room. You know, I definitely had room on my screen, but... Yeah. Let's put some potatoes on your roof there, Jeremy. Oh, that's good. Cleans up that row. There's only like one, like single row there. I'm not too fussed about it. I've got plenty of potatoes as it is. How will we go for the second time? I'll go a little bit wider and see if it'll. Allow. There we go. Yep. That went all right. Not too bad. No damages, so that's good.
That didn't take too long, to be honest. I mean, it took a bit of time, but not... It wasn't horrible. I'd hate to do a massive yeah. paddock, but... Yeah, that's when you'd get the self-propelled one, I think. Yeah, you'd have, like, yeah. two of them going. Alright, there's another 3,000 litres. The mirrors are no good, I can't see anything. There we go. How much do you have in there, Brent? 600. How much is in the trailer, Jeremy? 39,000. How much did you have in the previous one? 59. 59 and 39. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too that's bad at all, thing. to be honest. Yeah, no. Fine. I'll return this implement to the shop, but, um... Yeah. I'm pretty happy with that. 39,000 litres and 59,000 litres. Oh. Those are some pretty strong leaves on that hitch there. Well, that must be about 90,000 litres all up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fucking hell. Right, I'll return this to the shop. Alright, guys. Um, we're going to return this potato harvest to the, to the shop. The one that Brandon's got on is actually mine. I actually own that one. But I went and leased this one so that we could have two going at once just to speed it up a little bit. Um, but yeah, that was my first time potato harvesting on Farming Sim. I've never done it IRL either, so, um, that was a learning curve for me. I didn't know exactly how that machine would work, but it works okay. Um, we got a pretty nice yield, to be honest, from, from the crop. So we got a pretty good quantity, and we're getting, I mean, it's not an amazing price, but I mean, I don't know how much they sell for in real life either, so... I mean, 18,000 for the load that Jeremy sold previously isn't too bad considering the amount we got of potatoes, so yeah, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed the videos and I'll see you next time.